And when we provide health insurance for every American, we will be a much more just society. And we'll have a stronger economy. This road's out ahead of us. I'm going to be joined by my colleagues. I'd like my colleague from Florida to join us here. Federico Wilson, would you please join us? Thank you for sharing this hour with me. Representative Garamendi from California, my dear friend. Mr. Speaker, who could be against making every American eligible for health care insurance? I can't even imagine. So I'm here today to help set the record straight about Obamacare. I'm here to explain what Obamacare means to the people in my community and the people around this nation. And I'm here to explain the truth, the real truth behind the health care reforms that are moving ahead on Tuesday, October 1st, simply because Obama cares. Mr. Speaker, this health reform is about making it easier and cheaper to get insurance if you don't have it. It's that simple. Our President Barack Obama cares and is making health care easier to obtain. He cares and is making health care more affordable. President Barack Obama cares and is making health care more accessible. Now listen up. If you have Medicare, this does not apply to you. This has absolutely nothing to do with you. It will not affect your coverage. If you have Medicaid, this does not apply to you. If you have a job with health care coverage, this does not apply to you. Obamacare only applies if you do not currently have insurance. You will finally have the opportunity to gain protection for your body. You will finally find peace of mind. You no longer will have to fear of being bankrupted by a health emergency. You no longer will have to let your health suffer by avoiding the doctor. You no longer will have to fear for your family going without care. Mr. Speaker, there are very few simple steps for getting started if you're uninsured. Because Obama cares, you can get started with these simple directions. If you have access to the internet, you can get started right away. Beginning Tuesday, October 1st, healthcare.gov will give you all the information you need to sign up for this program. Once you're there, go to the tab that says Get Insurance. Mr. Speaker, this will take you to a page that will explain all the insurance marketplaces available to you. You will be able to compare all the plans available to you in your area. Mr. Speaker, the internet is the best way to sign up. But if you're not comfortable using a computer, ask a friend or ask a young relative to help you survey the choices. Young people know all about computers. 
If you need additional help, you can also call 1-800-318-2596. People are available around the clock to offer assistance in more than 150 languages. And in Miami, that is very important. They can help you enroll by mail if you prefer. Mr. Speaker, Obama cares so much that there will also be expert advisors called navigators in your community. You can find them at community health centers, at the mall, in drugstores, and in many places of worship. In some states, traditional insurance agents and brokers will be able to help. But remember this, if someone tries to charge you money for advice on how to sign up, say no, because it is a scam. No one should be charged for assistance in signing up. Mr. Speaker, Americans should take their time in completing the important task of choosing the right health insurance plan. I know sometimes it can take two hours to choose the right pair of shoes at the mall, or two hours at the kitchen table to choose the right cable TV plan. Be patient. Take your time in choosing the right plan to protect your body and your life. You won't regret it. Mr. Speaker, Obama cares because health reform